nothing the old people have ever known. Greetings Special Centurions and welcome back to another live stream. I was trawling through my discovery queue on Steam looking for a noteworthy title to pick up and take a look at and I came across this promising looking little gem. It's a tactical warband mercenary management game similar to the ones I've been that I love and that I've been playing a lot recently on my channel. Uh, it looks quite a lot like War Banners in terms of its style and its presentation. But yeah, I thought we should download it and check it out. And already we're greeted with this awesome, heavy, sort of metal, um, yeah, metal guitar music. It's really cool. That combined with the art style and just the general graphic present graphical presentation of the game is uh, really making me like this. This guy looks exactly like Ike. He's wearing the same outfit that Ike from Fire Emblem wears. So I'm interested to see where this game goes. It looks really promising and interesting. <coughs> Excuse me. Just before we get started, quick shout out to all the new viewers and subscribers of the channel. Welcome to the Special Legion. Thank you for joining. I do appreciate your support and camaraderie. Please do stop by a live stream sometime to say hi or visit our Discord server linked down below in the uh, description to, um, yeah, stop for a chat. I greatly appreciate it. I'd love the opportunity to get to know you a bit more. Um, yeah, apart from that, I say we just dive straight in, shall we? We're going to start a new game. This is the demo, so I'm not sure what to expect, but yeah. Let's see what it has to offer. Who goes there? Show yourself. A friend. Suppose you are. Move your head and prove it. 
It's been too long, Ro. Wesley. Ah, the famous general finally shows his face. That I do. That I do, folks. Take it in in all its glory. On second thought, I prefer you to leave the hood on. <laughs> pardon my disguise, Ro. I will pardon your rancor. I had to conceal my movements. And why is that? This mission has been approved by the Commander General, has it not? Not exactly. It was a request from an old friend in the Commons. He is convinced it will lead us to Duke Crawford's doorstep. We're rangers, not rebels. Our orders come from the King, not the feckless politicians in the, com in the Commons. Operating in the shadows like this is tantamount to treason. Call it what you will, but there is no cost we wouldn't bear for the liberation of our people. A liberation that will be impossible while Crawford remains the High Duke. Sir, you haven't changed a bit. Regardless, the only thing passing this way are rats and rubbish. I'm losing faith that this caravan will show. Patience, Ro. My informant was adamant. They've used this route consistently for weeks now. Ro! General Wesley, sir. What is it, Benjamin? Caravan's been spotted, camped out just a few leagues from here. Then it is time. Let us move swiftly. What if you're wrong, Wesley? Then we forget this ever happened. It's the steps we must take if I'm right that worry me. There will be no turning back. Any qualms? Nay, I say nay, my lord. <clears throat> so it's got this kind of low res, low poly, cartoonish graphical style to it when it's not doing cutscenes and conversations like this. That sigil, no doubt, Iroquois soldiers. That sigil, I see. So he says, that sigil, no doubt, Iroquois soldiers. Why would Duke Crawford have a caravan escorted by Iroquois guards? We need to search their cargo if we are to have any answers. Let us wait until they sleep, then we slit their throats. Travelling through fern is not a crime, Ro. We are not at war with these people any longer. Asking will get, it, will get us nowhere. We need a plan, not pleasantries. If the informant was wrong, we should be we would be killing innocent merchants. Oh shit. This is when you start questioning your informant? <laughs> Benjen, don't just sit there, say something. Hmm, <laughs> leave me out of this. They're Iroquians, travelling through fern under the cover of night, being confronted by rangers. I think we all know how this is going to go. Uh, all I ask is for the chance to parlay to avoid unnecessary bloodshed. And when diplomacy fails? That's where you come in. Yeah, but we would have lost the element of surprise then, dickwad. Who goes there? Avasala, Iroquan. What business do you have in Fern? My business is none of yours. On the contrary, all foreigners must declare their goods when travelling into Fern. And this writ gives me the right to search your caravan. We bring apples and peaches. Nothing you need to concern yourself with. I trust it's nothing exciting, yet by law I must inspect it nonetheless. Your meddling edges closer to a grave mistake. I'll give you one more chance to step aside. There are things more frightening than Fern's laws. Men, seize him. Use only as much force as necessary. I had hopes he wouldn't come to this. So yeah, it turns. Though in, in those who rule combat is turn-based. The player and enemy will alternate acting with all their units until the condition for victory or defeat is met. You can end your turn early by clicking escape or something, an icon, oh right mouse click I think and hitting end turn, yeah. Do you start click on one of your units, click to continue, ah, I see, okay. Movement, your unit can move up to four tiles per turn unless under an enemy's zone of control. Left click to move and right click to cancel. Use the WASD keys holding down that or screen edges to look around the map. All units equipped with a melee weapon exert a zone of control. Entering the front three hex tiles of an enemy unit will exhaust the rest of the unit's movement points. If the unit starts their turn affected by an enemy zone of control, they'll only have one movement point when it's their turn to move. Okay. Combat. After moving, select an enemy to attack. Hovering over a unit will show a battle preview. Unit. <coughs> excuse me. 
units that have more of four or more agility than their opponent will double attack. Oh, cool. That's interesting. Hover over any parts of the UI for a tooltip explanation. Archer fights from a distance. Their precision makes them deadly. Well, what's he getting into combat for then? Sharp shot, passive. All bows have plus one range. Okay. Vitality 28. The total amount of damage this unit can take before falling in combat. Shield. The amount of damage this unit's shield can block. Once repleted, once depleted, damage will be done directly to Vitality, regenerated at the start of the unit's turn. Uh, okay, so shield is literally like a shield, but it's an indication of their block in this game. Good to know. Iron Sword. So that's the health. That's the damage. I'm going twice because my um, agility is four times higher than this guy's, I guess. Or four, four more, more, four, more than four greater than his agility. Jesus. Yikes. What a sentence. So I guess we're just doing this. Oh, okay, so it's very similar to Fire Emblem then. Gotcha. After a unit acts, you will select the direction they will face. Striking from behind guarantees a hit, so make sure to keep your enemies in your sights. Hey, that's cool. That's a cool ability. You can donkey punch them, which makes them turn around. Looks like he needed us after all. Benjamin, let's attack from the flanks to gain the upper hand. Yeah, you don't say. Attack directly behind for a critical hit. Flanking. Attacking from the tile directly behind a unit is a backstab. Backstabs deal extra damage, always hit, and cannot be countered. Attacking from the other two flanks. Sorry, attacking from the other two tiles behind an enemy is considered a flank. Flanks give the attacker extra hit chance and avoid. Okay. So that tile there would be a backstab. Yeah. Killed. <laughs> oh no, he's going to kill Benjin. Items just like one of the units is injured. Luckily, they all have a light bandage. When used, this item heals 10 health. Items with active effects have a limited number of uses per chapter, but will refresh with each new map. Okay. So what am I doing? Selecting a hero. Take the leader out and go face that way. You can use a bandage. Twice. Oh, you can only use one once, and that's your turn. Okay. Oh, thank goodness that missed. Don't turn around, you idiot. You're exposing your flank. Got a low chance to hit heal instead. What's this? Taunt. Taunt's the name of the one tile to attack this unit. Taunt will take the shortest route to attack this unit that taunted them. That's cool. Just kill him. <laughs> Nice. So yeah, it's like Fire Emblem and Dark Deity and stuff like that and the way that the experience bar works and leveling up works. 
Benjin Row, secure the perimeter. Right. <clears throat> Here we are. Wait. What is this? According to the contract, God's sake, this goes deeper than mere treason. Benjin Row, we're done here. Benjin Row? Oh, he's been betrayed. This is quite the surprise, Avasala General. Avasala must be hello or something. It's a greeting that they use. Because that's the second time you said it. As like an introduction. Avasala General. Prince Zoltan! Or how shall I say former? What do I owe the honour? No need for pleasantries, General. You have been summoned to Iroqua, and I am to ensure your escort. Apologies, Prince. I must unfortunately decline. My soldiers and I are expected in Fern. General, you are outnumbered. No. Come with us quietly, or none of you will leave this place alive. Iroquans are not known to let their captives live. You place too much faith in rumours, General. So you've made your decision? Yes, allow me to display the famous hospitality of Fern. Cool. Run, my love. You must run faster. I can't, mother. I can't keep up. Ah, uh, my love, please, we have to keep moving. We're almost to the woods. No, I just want to stay here, Mom. Honey, duck. Oh, she's going to get nailed by arrows. Mother. Oh, that dream. I'll never let that happen again. Oh, okay, that's what happened to me as a kid. Last call. Damn it, already late. Where did I leave that gambeson? That's more like it. Marcus, wake up. Hmm? Huh? Find someone else to help you in the forge today. What? I'm not your dad, idiot. We need to get moving. Evaluation is about to start. W what? Isn't that next week? Gross, Marcus, your breath. How much did you drink last night? I may have had a mead or two. But, or three. Enough, I'm not leaving you behind. Come on, get up. Aye, aye, Captain. I'll grab you some armor. Oh, you slept in your uniform. I'm actually impressed that you were prepared. Don't be. I always wear whatever I wake up in. Let's get out of here. <laughs> That's hilarious. Oi, watch where you're going, you stupid. Excuse me? Ahem, forgive me. Haste my outpaced manners. My haste outpaced my manners. No harm done, though in the future I might suggest a keener awareness. The battlefield favours those with eyes wide open. I'll count this as my first lesson then, the art of navigating our dangerous barracks. A valuable skill indeed, if you'll excuse me, I'm already running late to the ranger's evaluation. Now that'll be a sight, someone so small trying to join the rangers. She steadies herself quicker than you, guess size isn't everything. I'll remember that. <laughs> That's cool armor. That's really cool. I like it. I don't know how effective it would be, but he looks cool as shit. If you've made your way to this corner of the castle, then you know we are who we are, so let's skip the pleasantries. If you've heard of the rangers, then you've heard of the survival rate. You've heard of the jobs we take. We do the, what the rest of this army can't. We are the best Fern has to offer. If you have a good head on your shoulders, keep your head down and follow orders. You might just have what it takes. Look around you. Not all of you will make it through what's coming. Being a ranger means facing death daily and doing it willingly. If you're not ready to pay that price, now's the moment to step aside. The regular ranks might be better suit those might better suit those unprepared for the ranger's sacrifice. Dead silence, music to my ears. I know many of you wish to train under our celebrity general Wesley. Unfortunately he couldn't make it today, so you'll have to settle for Bruce. He'll be taking you through the first day's task. This is your chance to separate yourself from the rest. I suggest you don't waste it. All right, runs. Organize yourselves into groups of four. And choose wisely. You'll pass or fail this evaluation together. Teams are forming fast. Got anyone in mind? Marcus? 
Bates got a strange sense of humour throwing us together again. I wouldn't call it a sense of humour, maybe a test of patience. Perhaps a test we can take on as a team. Looks like you've already made a friend. What's his story? Haven't got that far yet. You in uh, Arnold or do we need to audition? What? Oh, I see. Arland, not Arnold. A different person. Gotcha. Ahem, Arland. And no need for auditions. I'll hold my own. Had some fine armor for recruits. Seen anything beyond the parade grounds? Didn't think tar stained hands would scoff at proper maintenance. All right, you two. We'll have plenty of time to spar at the grounds. Let's get moving before we're left behind. Recruits, the goal of today's exercise is simple. Drop your opponents by any means necessary. If you fall, you've been eliminated and will sit out the rest of the exercise. You've all been given blunted weapons, so lethal force is prohibited. Anything else goes. The last team standing will be our winner. Everyone get into positions. Okay. Abilities. Along with basic attack, units will have access to other abilities based on their class, equipment and personal abilities unique to each unit. For example, since all your units are equipped with an iron shield, they'll have access to shield bash ability. Press E on a unit to view all the details. He's out in the open. The terrain won't help him against an attack from the flank. Scott Slyker. Flank him with a shield bash to stagger him. Then you strike him while he's dazed. I like it. Don't tell me what to do, wench. Uh, e. Unit details. In this UI, you can see a unit's level, stats, equipment, abilities, and weapon exp expertise. Hover over anything to learn more about it. Okay, attack. How much damage a unit will do on their attack? Determined by the unit's strength plus weapon damage. Speed. How much speed this unit has? If 4 plus higher than the enemy units... Yeah, if, if more than 4 higher than an enemy unit's speed this unit will make an extra attack during combat cool dodge the likelihood this unit will dodge an incoming attack determined by units agility times three i think when it says agility it means speed yeah it must mean speed because it said agility twice now but i don't see an agility stat anywhere i do see speed though so i guess they've just got an inconsistency in the descriptions there a bit at this stage that's fine whatever uh, dodge, yeah, De increase and decrease by terrain, movement is 4, the amount of tiles this unit may move, build, how much weight this unit can carry before incurring an agility penalty, we'll re reduce agility by 2 for each point of total unequip- wait, we'll reduce agility by 2 for each point of total equipment weight over this value, I see, okay, so the higher the build the more equipment they can carry. Hit 90, the chances the unit's axe will hit, determined by the weapon's hit chance plus the unit's skill attribute, times 3. Oh, here's agility, I see, gotcha. Okay, so dodge is agility then, yeah. So vitality, yeah, strength, skill, hit chance, agility, dodge chance, as well as the chance to double enemies, double hit enemies, yeah. Endurance, the carrier's weight, and defense is... How much damage the unit negates during combat. Okay, cool. Iron shield, shield bash. Bash the enemy with your shield doing strength damage and staggering them for a turn if the target is injured. Staggered unit loses 25 hit and avoid cannot be blocked. They need to be injured though first. Oh, cool, and they've got growth rate attributes. Growth rate attributes. So he'll get loads of vitality, loads of strength. Yeah, basically vitality and strength is this guy's foray. So what's the other guy? Whoops. E. Skylo is a soldier. What's he got? 75, 50, 50, 55. Yeah, so he's basically the same. He's actually better, isn't he? Attack 14, hit 90. Attack 10, hit 108. Yeah, so he's basically lighter. He's more defensive and less offensive. He's got more defensive damage. Allies within one tile gain 15 hit chance. Nice. 
kick. Kick a unit doing strength damage and moving them back one tile if empty. Cool. First strike. Always hit attacks first. Always attacks first when attacked with a non first strike weapon. When initiating combat, gain 20 chance to hit. That's cool as shit. Okay. What's this guy's training sword? Parry, passive. Okay. Uh, Guardian. Allies within two tiles that are below 40% health gain two defense. Okay. Taunt. Yeah, cool. Yeah, okay. What's the growth weight of this defender? Health and endurance and defense. Yeah, health, endurance and defense they get. So they're more like the generals. Generals in the uh, Fire Emblem. Mr. Chef de Cuisine. Hello. Hello, I wasn't at the end of last stream, but I am here for the entirety of this stream, hopefully. No worries, mate. Kick back and relax. I hope you enjoy. It's not going to be too much of a long stream because it's only a demo. So it, it will just go for however long the demo goes for. And I think it's going to be about another half an hour or 20 minutes or so. And then I'm going to end the streaming for today. But I hope you enjoy what I'm doing, uh, what I do for you at the moment. Yeah. Uh, cool. And then we'll check out her and see what she's got. She's a skirmisher. So she'll basically be a ranged unit. Aptitude gains 50% more weapon XP. Can move two spaces after an action if not in an enemy zone of control. So she can throw and then move back two tiles and then throw and then move back, I reckon. Vitality strength, skill, agility. Yeah, skill and agility she's going to get. So she's going to be like a ranged unit. Anyway. Do that and shield bash him. You have inflicted a status effect on a unit. Hover over the unit to see the unit's quick info at the top right, where you can see the description of the status. Most abilities that do damage, like shield bash, only apply the status when damaging a unit and enemy's health. Injuring. Reading the read the descriptions carefully. Oh, I see. So he didn't have to be injured. He just needed to lose health from it. If the target is injured, when it says if it's injured, it doesn't mean if they have an injury. They mean if they lose health at all. So as long as they lose health, they gain stunt, they gain staggered for a turn. Yeah. So yeah, that's cool. Oh, he missed. Fucking plonker. Arlen, can you buy us some time to the south? I'll do my best, but please, sorry, the shield will only last so long. Why would you do that? These guys can only move to there, so why they can't actually get in range of us. Yeah, they can't get in range, so why would you move into range? Why don't you just stay here? Uh, and, and turn and face that way, and you can come and have an attack. Yeah, good kill, good kill. And then she can move too. That's brilliant. That's awesome. Oh, well, we have to finish all of them. Certain terrain will cost more or less movement points to traverse. For example, the bush tiles that are around this map will cost two movement points, while standard terrain will cost only one. However, it will also increase the dodge chance of the unit standing on it, using the terrain to advantage is key. Ah, oh, I see. So evasion goes up by 20 and gives you one defense. Evasion goes down when you're standing on rocks. Ah, oh, cool. So we want to we want to Doctor Mantle here, basically. I didn't know that we'd have to fight all of these guys.
get the kill. Even though it's a waste of an attack in theory. Sounds like music to my ears. I know how you feel, Mr. Chef de Cuisine. I know how you feel, my friend. Good block. Oh, I forgot he could move into the bush. I thought it was a... Uh, for some reason, I thought it was like Battle Brothers, where it would block, the, the bush would block him, even though it literally just explained to me how it worked. That was really stupid. I left him completely wide open. Shields, your unit shield has taken damage. When a unit with a shield is attacked, the shield will generally take damage first up to its block amount. This block amount will regenerate by a flat amount at the start of the player's phase, depending on its regen value. If an attack only damages the shield, it is considered blocked and will not inflict status effects. Yeah. Flanks and backstabs will always ignore the defender's shield. Okay. Marcus, it's like you're allergic to staying in one plate piece. Do not forget to use your bandage. We don't want your clumsiness holding us back. Shut up, woman. I don't want to waste my AP on a bandage. Time to pounce. They're weakened and ripe for the picking. I'm not weakened. You're weakened. Uh, shield bosh him? No, kick him. No. Actually, yeah, go. Oh, you can't. No, just attack him. Just attack him. Haha, <laughs> see? I didn't need your bandage nonsense. Okay, okay, okay. Cool, 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 cool. Okay, so there's no chance to re-roll them like in the other game. You just get what you're given. Cool, I like it. Whoops. Who's weakened now, you ninnies? Stab. Stab. Actually, use the bandage now that you have it. <laughs> ah, I miss me. That guy leader. Yeah, that guy's a leader. Or oh, he's a bit more powerful than the other guys we're facing anyway. Nice. Okay, I'll take it. Dagger him. Nice. 
Now finish it. Nice work. Mm, not a great level, but whatever. Yeah, we did it! I have to admit, you weren't as bad as you looked at the start. Is, is that a compliment? I can't believe what I'm hearing. Don't get used to it. You still have plenty to clean up. If anyone wasn't pulling their weight, it was me. Thank you all for allowing me to join the team. Nonsense. You were much more useful than Marcus. In fact, that's enough. You fought well, but this was only the first test. In a real battle, your opponent is defeated when they no longer breathe. But you'll learn that soon enough. The winners can return to the barracks. The rest of you, in positions. We go again. Zoltan. Comfortable, General Wesley. We strive for the best, especially... I don't know why he said so posh. He's clearly got a really gravelly, deep, weird voice like this. We strive for the best, especially for our distinguished guests. My men... Oh, it's Wesley. Fuck, he's fucked up. My men, Zoltan, where are they? Are you thirsty, General? <laughs> no. Pity. The locals tell me it's good wine. I must confess my men are overjoyed at the thought of beheading a ranger general. You've killed many of our people. And you, ours. The scars of a long war of a war long past. Be at ease, General. I have no intention of continuing that cycle today. But, alas, our guests must sometimes pay a price. Uh-oh, who's Mujari? Ah, my kidney! There are people in your country who want your head, and you are pe you are ready to pay quite handsomely for it, and who are ready to pay quite handsomely for it. What are you, chop? They'll have to settle for a hand. Pant, pant, pant. Oh, he passes out. See to his wounds, the general story is far from over. He'll have a part to play in the coming months. Yes, sir. Oh my god, they chopped his hand off. Ambush! Archers in the trees! What? An arrow? They must have spotted our campfire. More are coming, take cover. Ah! Abigail, she's been hit. Where did it pierce you? Arlen, that was close. Shield's taken the hit. Oh, thank the gods. Come as quickly as they appeared. Gone as quickly as they appeared. Another test by the generals. And we walked right into it. Blunt tip or not, these tests are more lethal than I expected. This makes three ambushes in a row. How much further until the ruins? Half a day's march. Let's clear the area and get some rest. We need to head out at dawn. I hope the others are faring better than us. Ah, Marcus, what's the matter, pray tell? This hunger's gnawing at me. Feels like days since our last meal. Sigh. Well, what misfortune was I assigned this babysitting duty? I've been asking myself that question for weeks now. My, in my current state, I can barely wield my axe. All your rations gone on the first day. What did you expect? How was I supposed to know I'd be traveling and fighting for four days straight? The soldier must always be ready, Marcus. And we only have one more day to find the ruins. Well, I can't sleep hungry, so first I'll take first watch. You two get some rest. Here, really? But aren't you hungry? Famished, but better me hungry than, than us weakened. You'll need your strength for the watch. Besides, I suspect the others are scarcely faring any better. Good morning! Whoa, another amazing breakfast. Thank you, Arland. Your cooking is the only thing making this mission, mission bearable. Your arrows do the hard part. I merely dump the rabbits into a pot. Sure, but it takes skill to turn a simple catch into a feast. Stop being so humble. Quick meal, then we move. Every moment counts. So, these are the famed ruins of Aramir. Quite a step down from the legends. And no sign of the enemy. Still, we should be careful. They could be anywhere. Indeed, we must tread cautiously. Yahoo! Just goes running and jumps into the ruins. Ha! We finally made it! Marcus, you idiot, have you forgotten there may be enemies nearby? Oi, right. This place gives me the creeps, but at least we can rub in rub it in Slyker's face that we got here first. 
Well, let me have it. Ah, when did you get here? Shush. Seems you're always one step ahead, doesn't it? Abigail and Arland are searching for the traitor prince's sword as we speak. Hard to imagine royalty hidden within these crumbling walls. The past is full of surprises. Slyker! Oh, Marcus, you made it much earlier than I expected. Huh. Abigail, what news? About a dozen recruits shadowing the ruins. We couldn't get close enough to find the traitor prince's sword. Just double our number. We can handle that. We say we march straight in, ring their skulls, and worry about the sword after. I actually agree with Marcus for a change. We're still being tailed by another group. If we're not quick, they'll reinforce the recruits in the ruins and our chances of finding the blade are gone. Yeah, uh, exactly what I was thinking. <laughs> That's the spirit, Marcus. Quick thinking as always. Alright, everyone, stay close together. We strike as one. Classes. Every unit starts with one of six classes. Fighter, soldier, skirmisher, defender, archer, or medic. Each class has unique abilities, promotions, and weapon types that they can use. Okay, well I'm not going to bother getting into that now because this is just a demo. But yeah, I'd be well interested in like getting into that and finding out all the different classes and experimenting and stuff with it and just, yeah. Do they always counterattack, or do they just have a certain number of counterattacks? He seems to just always counterattack. Oh, of course it misses. Oh, but she got second strike. Nice. Good work. Healing. Healers are typically not great duelists, but they can heal the injuries of those around them. So, Phoebe it must be a healer. Gentle heart. When using mend on an ally, restore half the health restored to the ally to yourself. Hey, cool. So yeah, she's a healer. Mend. Heal a unit by a third of their total HP rounded down. So how do you do that? I guess you just move next to them. Yeah, move next to them and heal. Yeah, cool. Okay. Okay, okay. Cool. Range weapons. Archers can shoot enemies from afar, but won't be able to fight in melee range with a bow. Ranged attacks cannot be counterattacked, even if a defender has a bow. So if you stay, oops, if you stay there, how far can you shoot? One, two, three. Okay. Well, that was pointless. That did absolutely nothing. Dong. Hey, stop shooting her in the butt. Chests contain items that are sent to your storage and can be equipped in the preparation phase of the next chapter. To open a chest, simply put at any of your units adjacent to it and hit the chest button above the action bar. Well, yeah, I get that. You can definitely heal her. Face that way. You can come around behind here and get this archer. Nice. Nice. Ow. Hey, good level. Oh, I faced it the wrong way. Bollocks.
So what is this a game about? I'm not too sure, to be honest. In terms of um, plot, it seems to be some kind of invasion. It's kind of like Fire Emblem, where you're uh, the recruits of a soldier, soldiery in a kingdom, and your kingdom gets invaded, and you have to um, fight and level your soldiers up, and the plot unveils itself as you continue through the missions. Um, it's a tactical, turn-based soldier management strategy crpg game kind of like fire emblem kind of like war banners something between some kind of mix between the two and uh looks really promising so yeah i'm really enjoying it abigail you're hurt again maybe shoot from behind me so i can protect you you fret more than an old hen i've been hunting longer than i've been walking i know i know just these aren't rabbits they're hunting you as much as you are them well i reckon i ought to start practicing on something that shoots back don't go worrying about me arlen i can handle myself yeah stop being a a nosy, bossy, doo-doo head. Yeah. No. You can stay there and shoot. No, stay... No. Stay there and shoot the archer. You can come here and attack him. She'll get two attacks. Yeah, nice. Healer can come here and actually heal him. Does men cost anything? Does he have like magic or whatever? Don't think so. Owie! Prick. Oh shit, they got reinforcements behind us. I want to guess to ourselves, let's find the blade before we're trapped. So what, is it in one of those chests? I guess it's in one of the chests. Heal her. Face that way. Ah, miss me. Jeez, boshing back, nice. Oh dear. Nice level out, Abigail. Very, oh no, maybe not. It was a good kill, but you didn't get a good level off it, unfortunately. Uh, you can just mend her and just stand behind her mending because that's she's going to be in a pickle probably for a while. Goodness, I missed. We're in quite a bit of trouble here. Oh, I didn't kill him, left him on like one hit point. That is bullshit. Um, 
Um, <clears throat> stay there for the moment and heal. Damn it, that's unfortunate. I wanted to get through this round. Okay, we're in trouble now. stay there and block his attacks and try to take minimal damage. Um, nice, good level. to here and face this way. Haha, miss me. Now you're dead. Okay, that turn went pretty well actually. We're doing much better than I thought we were. Twat! Go and get the chest. Cool, 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 cool. Squish. Yeah, nice, got it. That means the other chest is empty or, or has nothing valuable in it. I guess the mission's going to end now, probably, before I can get to it and find out. I really like it. It's quite simple, but it's quite cool. Simple but enjoyable. I'm looking forward to seeing how it de how um, uh, it develops, how what it's like when it comes out, because this is really cool. Oh, we have to get both chests, obviously. Medium bandage, right. Okay. Yeah, it's quite a good game. Yeah, it's got a really good uh, foundation they've laid out here for the game. I really hope to see them improve upon it and see what they build with it. Bruce, an impressive feat, recruits. I can't remember the last time we've had a group make it all the way to the Traitor Prince's Blade. 
You understand why we do this drill, don't you? It's a symbol of victory, isn't it? The rebellion fell with that sword. You're only scratching the surface, lad. This sword is far more than a trophy. It's a testament. That sword represents our resolve, our dedication to protecting this kingdom. Twenty years ago, that damn prince nearly tore us apart from the inside. It has a lot of potential. Yeah, you're absolutely right, Mr. Chef de Cuisine. It does have a lot of potential. And they've done really well with what they've done so far as well. It's not just like it's a crude game that has a lot of potential. It's, it's really well put together and it's already really good. So it's got huge amounts of um, potential if you extrapolate what they've done so far. He betrayed his own people. I've heard the stories. The tales don't do it justice. The chamber of peers murdered. The tens of thousands dead. Towns reduced to rubble. All because of this thirst for power. But the ranger stopped him, right? They were heroes. Aye, lad, heroes. You could call them that. They bore the sacrifices few others would stomach. All to ensure the safety of the realm. And that's what we're training for. To bear that burden. That's right. The rangers are the silent guardians of this kingdom. The shield that makes the brunt of any danger. That takes the brunt of any danger. It's no small task. <laughs> that sword stands as a grim reminder. We can't afford another rebellion. We can't afford another traitor prince. Halt! State your business. Is this your first time at post, lad? Open this damn gate before I drag you off from your tower. Ahem, open the gate. Gerard has returned. Gerard, you bastard. We were about to send a search party for you. Any word on Wesley? More riddles than answers, Bruce. He was last seen to the east, near Durden. The locals spoke of mysterious men involved moving under the cover of darkness. The descriptions match those of the Mujari. Mujari infiltrators and fern. What of the Eastern Duke, Crawford? Is he content with us standing idly by? Those are our orders, Henry, but all we know is that we can't rely on Crawford, not with Wesley's life at stake. Aye, Crawford's personal feud shouldn't interfere with our duties, but we're stretched thin as it is. Speaking of which, Bruce, what of the fresh blood? Have any shown promise? Aye, there's one team in particular, an odd bunch, but each with a spark of potential. They've handled pressure well. Good, then we found those flames. They might be our best chance of making room to breathe. Gerard, they're still green. We've never even assigned them this... We've never given an assignment this early. We've also never had one of our own generals taken from under our very noses. Get them ready. Their first real assignment awaits them at dawn. We'll free up more seasoned hands for Wesley's search. We can't afford any mistakes here. Then let's pray off faith in these newcomers as well. Place God knows we'll need all the help we can muster. Blimey, it's still going. I thought that might be the end of the demo, but we're an hour in, chat, and it doesn't look like it's going anywhere or ending anytime soon. Even the roosters aren't awake. They can't all be this early, can they? What's the matter, Marcus? Isn't this what you've always wanted? Even heroes need their beauty sleep, Ileana. But that's not something I'd expect you to understand. If the rumours are true, we'll be lucky to see our beds at all. At attention! Enough chatter, recruits. I want you to meet your commanding officer for this mission, Elias. Welcome to the Rangers, recruits. And this disgruntled-looking one is Rayson. Due to insubordination in his last assignment, he will hold the same rank as the rest of you. Your titles mean nothing to me, old man. Just give the orders already. Seeing as we need a second in command, Slyker will be filling that role for this mission. Pay attention, learn, and follow Elias's lead. Second in command? I... I won't let you down, sir. Am I being punished or sent to the gallows? This is ridiculous. Enough, Rayson. This is our squad for the foreseeable future. To make it this far deserves our respect. Your mission is to capture the pirates known as the Siren and Serpent. They've been a scourge in our coastal cities, but we've received intel on their next target. You'll launch a surprise uh, counter-offensive before they make off with their spoils. We'd prefer them both alive. Clear? Clear. Time to pack up and move out, Rangers. We'll make, this, we'll make the sea snakes regret setting foot onto Fern. Oh my god, we've even got a base going on here. Base. In the base menu, access the shop to buy and sell equipment. Manage units inventory. Forge powerful weapons and explore character conversations. <laughs> well, I'm going to save it first. 
Right, chat. I need to run to the loo. I need to get another drink. I will be right back in a few minutes. Don't go anywhere. This game's really good. See you when I get back.
All right, chat, I'm back and ready to carry on. Let's just take a brief moment, pause and enjoy this glorious music. I'm really enjoying what they've done with this game. It's really JRPG-ish. It's really Final Fan um, Fire Emblem-ish. But it's got its own unique charm. It's got its own battle map. It's got its own, you know, charm and um, mechanics going on. So I'm really appreciating it. Conversations. Budding Rivalry is a side quest. Watch and learn Open Secret and Folk vs. Sword. Folk vs. Sword. <clears throat> Let's check out the budding rivalry. Ha! Easy race, and the rest of us need targets to practice on too. Ha! Yeah! The way you're striking it, you think that bundle of straw is the reason you were demoted. I've got a quick. You've got a quick tongue, kid. This is all. This all must seem like a big fun adventure to you. But you better be served keeping your mouth shut, head down, and training more. But you'd be better served. I'm not opposed to a quick spa whilst the others pack their gear. What do you say? What's the matter? Too high and mighty to cross swords with a blacksmith's son? Scared what the barracks will think when they learn you lost? I didn't cross blades with novices. You never had to fight with your life hanging in the balance. How do you know what I faced? Because if you had, you wouldn't be so eager to prove yourself in a meaningless duel. So what are you saying? You need me to kill some pirates before you'll spa with me? Sure, kid. Take a couple out and you can have your prize. Just leave me be. Ha! What is this guy's deal? Watch and learn, bitches. Well, well, well. Slyker. A fresh face and already my deputy. Quite the de debut. Quite the debut, yeah. You flatter me, Elias, but... Or is it Elias? Elias or Elias? Probably Elias. But it's just the luck of the draw. Some would say that luck is a preparation meeting oppor is some would say that luck is preparation meeting opportunity. Ha, then my luck must have run out. I wanted to be a ranger for so long, but now that the opportunity is here, my stomach is in knots. It's one thing to look confident in training, another entirely to have lives depending on your every decision. You're only human, Slyker. We all felt that weight the first time we had command. It's a sign you care, that's important. Remember, you're not alone. If you know how to use everyone's strengths, there isn't a battle we can't win. And in the worst case, no one will be alive to hold it against you. A comforting thought, but my, bold, my goal is to keep everyone breathing, grudges or not. That's the right attitude, but remember, no mission goes exactly according to plan. We learn, we adapt, that's the most important skill a ranger can have. Thank you, Elias. You put my mind at ease. The dawn is breaking, we should get moving if we don't want to be left behind. Wow, the craftsmanship of this blade is impeccable. Nice sword. Ah! If you want to pose as a commoner, you should at least speak like one. We just say nice sword. Ileana, you must always sneak up on must you always sneak up on me? If you're so easily startled, you've got bigger problems than nice stealth. That's not it's not that. I was just absorbed. But how did you I am not posing as anything. Oh please, Phoebe, your manners, the way you speak, you refuse to eat with your hands. You're not exactly the typical ranger. There's nothing peculiar about being sanitary. I suppose they can't fool everyone. I've been training, trying to blend in, but... We all have our pasts, Phoebe. I'm not here to spill your secret. I didn't plan to mislead anyone. It's just there are reasons. I mustn't be discovered. Whatever your story, it's yours to share when you're ready. We're part of the rangers now. We'll have your back. Thank you, Ilyana. This is the first time I have ever felt at ease with my decision. What you make in Ireland? Just a humble stew, Abigail, something hearty for the road. Smells fancier than humble to me. 
Perhaps there's a dash of something extra, an artist touch, you might say. Artist touch, huh? See, I knew there was a secret ingredient. Uh, it's more about the process, the right amount of heat, the order of the ingredients, stirring with the right vigor. It's not unlike painting in that way. Never thought about it that way. Dad used to just throw things in a pot and call it a day. Sometimes simplicity has its own beauty, but there's also value in taking time to create something new. You're making it sound like it's more than just a stew. Even the most mundane tasks can be seen as art if you put your heart into it. That's a really good philosophy to undertake, actually. <clears throat> Try and make everything you do into an artistry. Into artistry. And yeah, just enjoy the process of what you're doing. Anyway, when you shoot your bow, the speed of the drawback, attention to the wind, the focus of the tar on the target, all contribute to the final piece. Sounds like something Dad would say, paying attention to the simple things. I think he would have liked you. I think he would have liked you. <laughs> I take that as the highest compliment, Abigail. Thank you. Now please, try the stew before it gets cold. Lance, how's it going, my friend? Welcome, welcome, welcome to the stream. I'm doing really well, thanks. Really enjoying getting back into streaming. How are you? What have you been up to? It's been too long. Um, conversations we just did. Shop. Let's see what we can buy and sell. Oh, we can sell the Traitor Prince's swords. Sharpened refinement. What's that? Weight one. Sharp and passive. During the first five rounds of combat, this weapon deals three damage. An extra three. Oh, I see. So it's a, you refine a weapon and make it sharper. That's cool. Good to know. Okay. Let's um let's go out of here. Let's uh, let's let's save it. <coughs> let's go to manage. Let's see what everyone needs to Yeah, info. Inventory. He's got an iron lance, an iron shield, and a light bandage. Music is so fucking good. Oh no, I'm sorry to hear that, Lance. That sucks. Been given severance pay for 10 weeks, starting on the 18th. The wife gave me a sickness and strep throat, but I'm on that level up. Oh, man, I'm sorry to hear that. I guess severance package is a good, uh, a nice little bonus to keep you on your feet for a while. Until you can find something else. What kind of thing are you looking for? I have 80 applications out. I was about to say that, Caesar. Music is very uplifting and energetic. Yeah, it's so beautiful. I'm really liking everything about this game so far. Forge. In the Forge, use Denari. Oh, cool. You even use Denari. It's, it's, this game is designed for us, chat. In the Forge, use Denari to upgrade your weapon's damage and hit chance. Manage refinement slots here to add unique abilities to your weapons. Only some weapons will have a refinement slot like Trader Prince's Sword. Remember, only one active ability per weapon and no duplicates. Iron Greatsword. Oh, I see, so you can put the damage up, or you can put the... Is that the accuracy? That's probably the accuracy. I see how that works. Cool, okay. 
Let's um let's go to the shop and buy that thing then. Sharpen refinement. We're gonna buy that. And then we're gonna go to the uh who had it? Ilyana has it. Oops. Manage Ilyana inventory. Uh, forge. Nice. Okay. <clears throat> okay, let's just save it and go on. This will probably be the final battle, I should imagine, of the demo, because we've seen everything the game has to offer now, I think. But, yeah, I'm really enjoying this. This is cool as shit. Looking for a project manager, business analyst, assistant program manager, and euphemisms for those titles. <laughs> cool, should I get them? What's this game? So this game is a mercenary slash soldier management tactical turn-based RPG uh, war game, kind of similar to F Fire Emblem, but the battlefield is kind of like war banners. And, uh, yeah, you just recruit soldiers and level them up like you do in Fire Emblem. And the story kind of unfolds and told between the characters as you advance through all the different missions. It looks really promising. It looks really cool. I found the demo of it available on Steam today, so I thought we should download it and check it out. And here we are. Spent the last couple of years up training, and then the company I worked for decided to pull roots and offshore to their workforce. Oh, man. That sucks. Bloody immigrants or emigrants or offshoring people. Whatever the word of them for them is. I was in a business process improvement department. I guess I worked myself out of a job. I can take that as an indirect compliment. <laughs> yeah. <coughs> it does. It does indeed look very crisp. The art style is very cool. And then the battlefield's kind of got this low res poly... Um, low poly cartoonish style figurine to it it's really cool our hold is packed full we've taken a good haul oh so these are the uh, pirates we're having to hunt aye the gods favoured us today sister denari we wouldn't see if we'd spend the days with nets and hooks our father spent his life with those nets and hooks you'd do well to remember that aye and I thank him for it but this this is a life he'd never dare dream of you say that as though it's a good thing we strayed from our simple roots far from our simple roots Far enough to dine on roast duck and quench our thirst with ale. Well, you can have my share. Our injured need me more than this ale. I'll be on the ship. Be sure to patch up those guards as well. They'll catch a hefty price back home. I'll make sure they're fit, but not to set sail. But not to sail, yeah. We've taken enough from these people. They captured, we leave behind. Bah, you were always too kind for this life, sister. Do as you wish. Good night, brother. Yeah, no worries, Lance. I get that as a sentiment entirely. I totally respect it. So yeah, sit back, relax. Let me entertain you for a little bit. I'm not sure how much longer I'm going to be going for. It's just to the end of this demo. And we're probably about halfway through it already. I think this is probably the last battle. But yeah, sit back, kick back, grab yourself a bevy and chill, brother. Sven, the bloody rangers, they're attacking the town square. Rangers, what about our watch? Slaughtered. They cut down half the men before we knew what happened. Oh, he's a pirate. I didn't notice. So these guys are like Viking pirate type characters. It's really cool. Gather the rest of the crew. They don't uh, step one foot further. We'll show these damn forest dwellers the might of Valyord. Been watching, following the YouTube videos. Oh, the, uh, the, the VODs, the VODs. I have a hard time seeing the Mordheim series. Yeah, I'm sorry about that, mate. It's quite a dark and gloomy game. It's designed to be, like, really difficult to see in any way, even if you don't have uh, difficulties uh, with seeing colour. So, yeah. Especially because the, the weird stones are green, basically. So, yeah. 
they'd appear probably grey to you or whitish and it would just be hard to see. I'm glad you're enjoying it though. Thanks for watching, mate. I really appreciate the continued support. <clears throat> Look at all this loot. Reckon it's enough to get our own brig. Aye, if we can get it back to the ship. Aye, if we can get it back to the ship. Rangers are swarming like flies on dung. We just need to buy a little time. The ride will be here any second. Hold them off. Have you seen how many there are? Ain't no way we're leaving all this behind, mate. I didn't raid this town just to turn tail at the first sign of a fight. Better to live a coward than a dead rich man, I always say. We're raiders, not cowards. Now grab a weapon, let's protect our spoils. Optional objectives. Most chapters will have optional objectives you can complete for greater rewards. You can see all the objectives for a chapter by pressing escape or hitting or clicking right mouse button and hitting objectives. The rewards for most optional objectives will be given in the best portion of the next chapter. In the base portion of the next chapter. Objectives. Sven defeated. So Marcus has to kill three enemies. And we have nine turns to defeat the pirates uh, guarding the chest. Of course, got to promote the home base here at Special Caesars Palace. <laughs> Mate, you make us sound like a gambling site. <laughs> Digging the artwork and attention to detail on the close-up art. Like, right, like, uh, right, look at that scarring. Yeah, I know. Yeah, 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 on the characters, yeah. So if we go, if we press C, or is it E? It was E, yeah, on these portraits. They all look really distinct, and they've all got really cool looks. And I really like this, this battlefield layout. This is cool as shit. So that's the guy we have to defeat. And then we have to just destroy these guys within nine turns. Personally, like the streams more. I don't quite get the gameplay with no one talking. Yeah, I get what you mean. I kind of regret doing it no commentary, but I was just playing it on my laptop one day, and I thought, "Hey, what what would this be like if we tried a zero death run?" And then I just got really far in it without anyone dying, and then I was like, "Well, I've started it without no commentary, so I'll just keep it as a no commentary." But if I do play more time again and try another warband, I will stream it live and then do a commentary of it live. It'll be mostly me just swearing in anger, but apparently people want to hear that. So people want to hear me raging and cussing and swearing in, in frustration as I miss 95% shots. Got to give the people what they want, right? I mean... Yeah, no worries, Lance. That's what I'm here for, you know, to host and hang out and chat. I mean, it might become a bit harder once if the channel gets really popular and chat's going really, really fast. But until that day comes, as long as I can read what you're saying, I'll always interact with you guys, of course. I'm here to host and entertain. So part of that is the interaction and camaraderie that comes with listening to and interacting with chat. I wouldn't dream of doing it any other way, really. We just make the entire thing pointless or less less productive. Haha, <coughs> <laughs> miss me, fool. Oh, I should have faced him the other way. <coughs> Two hundred weapons. Two hundred weapons will generally be more powerful offensively. Whilst giving up the ability to use a shield. Great swords can hit a second target in the next clockwise position of the original target. Clockwise, so that way. Spears can hit the unit behind the original target, though cannot target units two spaces away. Battle axes will crush shielded units. That's so cool. As your characters gain more endurance, they will be able to carry more gear, and you'll be able to bring multiple types of weapons and items into battle. Okay, so this guy can hit, like, here and there. So if I go here, it should hit both of them. Yeah. Yeah, so if I swing at this one, it'll hit both of them in a clockwise thing. Yeah. C 
cool. That's awesome. Swearing an English accent or hell Australian is always entertaining. Yeah, if I could pull off the Australian accent, but unfortunately, matey, it's just downright terrible. Ow. Yeah, swearing is always good sources of entertainment, especially if something un unbelievable happens or some bullshit happens. Like missing multiple 95% hit chance with t uh, twice or thrice. Yeah, when that happens, you have no choice. You have to fucking swear. Um, you have to swear. You have no choice to give vent. It's just... It's so irritating. Oh, I see. So the Iron Spear is a two-range weapon. Range one, yeah. Oh, no, it is only range one. Okay. So what's the... Oh, I see. So the spear goes through the target, but the lance is a one-handed thing. Does it say whether it's one-handed or two-handed? No, it doesn't. I guess you just have to know the weapons. So the lance is, for some reason, it should be the other way around, really. A lance was designed for charging, um, charging foes and spiking through, whereas a spear was just used for fighting. So it should be the other way around. But yeah, so in this case, the Iron Spear is used for penetrating and, and striking through twice. Striking through both enemies. Like that. Um, he's probably going to die now. Jeez. Oh no, you can come up and shoot the archer behind him. To kill the archer. Yeah, nice. Ow. Yeah, fucking Battle Brothers. Yeah, tell me about it. It was uh, our adventurer guild that got me this morning. We were fighting a necromancer and I missed like seven, seven shots in a row or something. Or six shots in a row. Two of them were like 95 percenters. And the other three were above 85 percent and we missed all of them. It was such bullshit. I got so aggro. Yeah, that's what Mr. exactly what Mr. Chef de Cuisine just said, yeah. If you can get a character name, you'll be Lancer the Lancer. It might be too late for that in this demo, but we'll definitely get you a character set up like that for our Adventurer Guild or something else that we play. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, the leveling up system is like Fire Emblem. It's really cool. Hey there, can't you see we're celebrating? Nothing kills a good buzz like a bunch of rangers. You're about to regret intruding on our fun. Stabby. Hack. Why are you shaking? The blood. Their blade was inches from my neck. I, I could have died. But you didn't and they did. Pull yourself together, kid. This isn't the time to lose your nerve. Yeah, exactly. You're fine, you pussy. Whoa, this guy's needing healing. Oh, no. Can you... No, because this guy's in zone of controlling him. Yeah. Whoa, this guy's got massive damage. Nice. No, wait. Where can he move to? Can't see. Move behind him for protection. Yeah, so if I go here, this guy can only attack him there. And if I go here, then... No, if I... Yeah, I go here and block like that, yeah.
The Adventurer's Guild is a tactical, it's similar to this, it's another mercenary management tactical RPG game where you manage a band of mercenaries, level them up, do loads of fights, and it's kind of like got Darkest Dungeon elements in it with D&D &D elements and stuff, and you've got loads of different characters. I've been streaming it on the channel for a few days now, I started on Wednesday I think, or Tuesday last week, and I'm, I'm really enjoying it, it's a lot of fun. It's really challenging as well. It's really getting my goat, this one. So we're playing it on the hardest difficulty. It's the first time I've played it. And uh, yeah, it's really good. You should check it out if you're interested in um, seeing what it's about and getting your character in there. Oh my god, are these guys just going to keep coming? Drunk, loses 20 hit and gains 2 defense. That's funny. Oh no, it's, it's there, isn't it? He needs to go... He needs to go there and then swing at both of them by doing that guy, yeah. And move over that way. Haha. <laughs> Owie! Oh, you fucker. I thought he was out of range. Oh no, I lost one. Okay, so obviously I would not normally be playing this fast and loose with my soldiers. I wouldn't have, like, I'd be, take, I'd be checking their ranges more and stuff. It's just because it's a demo, I don't really mind what's going on too much. I'm basically just charging forward to get the demo finished. I'm still enjoying it, don't get me wrong. I'm not making excuses here. I'm just not trying too hard to keep everyone alive. Because there's no point. Because the demo will end and then we won't... Yeah. The demo will end and it won't mean anything. Whereas if I was playing it properly, then I'd be trying to make sure that no one died. Marcus has defeated three out of three enemies. Poi effect. He can take the counter and then she can come in for the finish. Finishing blow. So when and what will you stream next time? Next stream is going to be probably on Sunday morning. Oops, don't do that. Sunday morning and will be our Adventurer Guild. You literally can't do anything, so just stay there. Can't do anything without triggering that guy. So yeah, it'll be Sunday morning and it'll be our Adventurer Guild. What turn is it? Turn 5. Where the fuck's he going? Ah, I miss me. 
Ah, I missed me. It's lucky he missed, actually. That probably would have killed. Oh, yikes! Ouch, kablibbles! Didn't know he could reach there. Really? You can't kill anyone? You're useless. Kill him. No. You need to use a you don't have a you don't have any bandages? Oh shit. We're in trouble. Use a good bandage. Face this way. You just stand there then. Shield bash. How'd you get your equipment out? Change your equipment to that, yeah. And attack him for the kill. Nice. Uh, face that way. Don't attack him. Just stay there. Damn, I didn't mean to click on him. Now he's going to die. I meant to just fucking cleanse his turn. That was so bad. Come up behind him and use a post. Oh, you don't have any bandages. That sucks. I meant to just end his turn and then face that way. Now he's going to die as well. The fucking second in command is going to die. Ah, oh, shit. It's all gone wrong, chat. It's all going wrong. Oh, thank goodness that missed. Jeez, he almost went down. Because of my terrible, terrible clicking. These guys are really powerful. Can heal herself up. Oh, you can only heal other people. Okay. So hit use a bandage then. Kill his lover. Kill him. Haha, <laughs> miss me. Miss again. It's because they're drunk. Yes, yeah, so their miss chance is really high. We need this archer to get some kills because he's just not very strong at the moment. She, sorry, isn't that very strong at the moment. She's got four strength, yeah. Jeez, bloody Louise. Die, you fucking drunkards. Yeah, I've got your treasure now, fuckheads. Bows are feeling weak. Almost want to see if crossbows were better. Yeah, well, I mean, we're only at the very start of the game and we don't know what the game has to offer. So, yeah, I hear you. Those are weak, but what can you do? Oh, I just noticed this guy missed her. That's lucky if she hadn't. If he hadn't have missed her, she, he would have fucked her up.
Thousand denarii. Okay, that'll be useful. Oh, he can only heal himself. That sucks. I oh, might as well use it now then. I thought you could use it on other people. I was hoping to use it on him. Okay, so these guys literally just locked down that position. That sucks. No! <laughs> oh man, I didn't know he could turn around and just fuck that guy up. I thought there was a zone of control, but there wasn't. We have to redo the battle chat. How do I skip all? Enter. Okay, so we know a bit more about how the characters work and stuff now. So, for example, Erason has a great sword. Oh, who is it? Elias. Someone did. Yeah, doesn't have a bandage. That's it. Elias doesn't have a bandage. So we're going to go to the shop. We're going to buy some more bandages. Two of them. Oh, we're going to also buy... Have we done the sharpen refinement on... Um... Who's... Was it? It was... Oh, it's Ilyana. It was that. Uh, let's go to the forge. Yeah, it's already got it. Okay, cool. So Ilias needs some more bandages. Oh, he can't. Okay, so Ilias. Drop the iron lance and take two bandages instead. Drop the shield because you don't need a shield if you've got a two-hand spear. Yeah. We're just going to buy a bunch of bandages. Actually, what can this can this guy use battle axes? No, just swords. Okay. So yeah, bandages are the best investment. We're just gonna buy a shitload. Because we can't do anything else with our money at the moment. We're just gonna give it to everyone. She doesn't need it. Maximum amount of items equipped. No, he's got one. He had another inventory space. Whoops. Oh, I guess that's a sh oh, that's a shield. I see. Okay, yeah, fair enough. So in that case, uh, he'll no. Who is the healer? Phoebe may as well carry the other bandage. Yeah, okay. And if that's the case, then Elias who has 5 out of 7, may as well take the shield. At least I can take his shield out and give him armor if I need to at some point. So that's fine. Yeah, that's much better. Save it. And let's go into the battle. Time to take the game more seriously. You're absolutely right. I want to actually finish it and I don't want to die again. Okay, so a bunch of drunks came out of there and came down this way. I think we just move everyone up this way and stay as a group. <sighs> oh, I missed him. Oh, that one missed as well. That's good.
Clout. I too want you to axe someone. I wish I could, my friend, but no one in our group can actually wield axes, so it's not going to work, unfortunately. Rather lamely. Oh, you prick. Oh, let me guess, this guy's going to come along here. No, he didn't, because we got zone of control. Okay, good. Doing a lot better in this one than we did last time, chat, I have to be honest. He needs healing the most, let's do that first. Oh, spears get to attack first, don't they? I need to remember that. It's lucky that I missed. Oh, I missed. That's annoying. Teehee. Getting much luckier with the attacks this round, the misses. <clears throat> and everyone's still alive as well, which is good, obviously. We haven't even used any bandages yet.
See he. Oh, come on, Naruto. Sort your shit out. Marcus, whatever your name is. Now this guy got twatted. That's annoying. Might as well do that thing because I can't do anything else. Hee hee. Owie. Got you, you little bastards. Kill. Good kill. Good kill. Ouch. Really? Double miss. Okay, that's fine. Triple miss. Good, he's defeated his three enemies.
Oh shit, I didn't know he could reach. <clears throat> yeah, get that archer up nice and high. Get him up, boy! Wish. Kill the archer before we can get another shot off. We don't want to be standing so we can double stab anyone, which we're not. So that's fine. Cheeky fuck. Oh, he double attacks. That guy's powerful. Yikes. Okay, well, what can we do? Uh, you can stand here and shoot this guy with a kill. And then face this way. You can step there and... Go for him. Nice kill. And face this way. You can come round and go for this guy. Very good. So now we can do some healing. Okay, on to the boss. Can we save it? Probably not. No, it's like Fire Emblem. You just have to carry on. Okay, so he doesn't move. He just comes up and attack. He just stands there and waits for you to attack him. Kind of like the traditional bosses in Fire Emblem. Can we just shoot the crap out of him with the archer? Okay, 
Yeah, you just use the medium bandage, it's fine. I hope he doesn't get to attack twice, we're fucked. Yeah, good. Yeah, the bay does any damage. <coughs> Let's see uh, if this guy can get the boss kill. No, he can't. Shit, how are we going to do this? We need to let him attack once more. Oh, he missed, thank goodness. Bosh. Now we can get him in theory. Oh, he missed though, and he's gonna bosh us back. This is tough. Oh, he's gonna kill this guy now. Don't tell me we lost it right at the very end. He's really hard to kill, and we don't have anyone who can do any like range joining them or anything. We could, but we could. Uh, what's he called? Shield bosh him, but I don't think that would do much. I think you just have to stand there and let him attack you until he dies from counter attacks. Well, fuck's sake! All right, chat. I'm gonna leave it there. That's so fucking irritating. It really is. Yeah, it basically, in order to beat him, you just have to stand there like a wally and let him attack you, and then just heal up, because, and then just counter attack him until he's dead. That was really annoying. Fucking RNG fucked us in the end again. Because we missed the attack when we attacked him and he hit us back. So, fucking typical bullshit. Um, but yeah, guys, I've had a lot of fun playing this. This looks really promising. This game looks awesome, to be honest. Uh, be sure to check it out on Steam. Go ahead and wishlist it. If you want to support the... Um, if you want to support the developers, then give it a wish list. That'll help the, the popularity of it grow. But yeah, guys, I'm Special Caesar. I'm going to call it quiz. I've had enough of fucking RNG for today, quite frankly. I really have. It's so fucking irritating. But yeah, guys, thanks so much for hanging out. I'll see you in the next episode. Should be Sunday morning. We'll be back with more Adventurers Guild. Hopefully see you there for that. If not, I will see you in some other content I produce. I try and make content every single day now. So, sorry till next time. Have a good day, guys. Cheers.